So recently on Ramblings with Rebecca, we've been talking about food. And we're going to be talking about food a lot more because it's the bulk of what I do and because there's a lot of vocab words relevant to it that I would like to explain to you, oh lovely internet. Uh, but that also can get a bit dry and it's the weekends. And I was like, well, I promised an episode every day, but do we really want to like explain environmental determinism on a Sunday? I mean, that's just a little bit much for a Sunday. And it's not even Sunday yet, it's Saturday, and that's a little bit much for a Saturday as well. So, I thought of a solution. See, I studied food security for a reason, and that reason is I really like food. Food is fun, and food is tasty, and food is delightful. And it is delightful to eat, of course. I myself also very much enjoy preparing and making it. Um, I'm less good at the whole gardening and actual initial production piece, although I do bits and bobs here and there. But I'm really, really good at once you're in the kitchen, let's do stuff with all of the little raw ingredients we've got all over the place. Especially when those raw ingredients are things like chocolate chips. <laughs> anyway, so I thought it would be fun to do a little bit of cooking and baking and thus prove my food qualifications to you or something. The other issue driving this is that several people ask me for my recipes when they eat something of mine. And I kind of go, uh, uh, mm, uh, mm. you see, I don't believe in recipes. Yeah. Um, so these are serving as my recipes. Um, we're gonna do a like cooking diary kind of thing where instead of eating, like writing down everything you have to eat when you're on like, you know, that weird, Thing that some instructors or teachers do and sometimes your doctor has to do it, whatever. No, we're gonna talk out everything I put in pots and see if we can manage recipes that way and get at what we're doing. So, I'm Rebecca Farnham. Welcome to Recipes with Rebecca. Today, we're not gonna cook anything. Instead, we're gonna do cooking versus baking. Because we've just finished up a unit in R Ramblings with Rebecca, the parent of this spin-off show, if you will, uh, on dichotomies. And I think there's a bit of a di uh, like dichotomy that's emerged around baking and cooking, actually. Uh, in a lot of families, one parent does most of the baking and one parent does a lot of the cooking. I know, sometimes they're seen as different kinds of things for some people. Um, I've also heard the phrase, cooking is an art, baking is a science, or something like that. I don't know if you've heard this. And I'm in a really uncomfortable position, so I'm going to move, and hopefully I don't fall backwards off this chair that I'm now leaning precariously on. Um, so, yeah, this idea that somehow when you're cooking it's an art and you can feel your way through what's going on and just kind of put spices in and it will come to you and it will be good. And then in baking, if you don't put the exactly correct amount of baking soda and or baking powder in, nothing will rise and it will be tar. So this baking is a science because you must follow everything exactly. I don't buy it. And this is why I have trouble sharing recipes with friends because you see I bake like one is apparently supposed to cook. And I just put stuff in. And then it goes in the oven and it's good. And it's lovely. And it's never the same and who cares? I mean, I guess you care if you're running some kind of sweet shop and you're supposed to actually like be able to produce the same thing over and over again. Fine, fine, fine. This show is not for you. I'm okay with that. But for the average person sitting at home who's just like using a Sunday afternoon in a semi-productive way or wants to have fun or like me enjoys eating and feels like they want to eat something other than the fake store-bought muffin, this is for you. We're going to learn that it's okay. And if you don't have half a tablespoon of baking soda, who gives a rip? It'll be fine and we'll make it work. Okay, so we're going to do that. Um, we're not going to do that today, but tomorrow we will have our first actual recipe on recipes with Rebecca. Haven't decided what we're going to make yet, uh, which is all to the better because it really buys into this whole whatever, put stuff in the pot. But if you have something in mind that you've eaten and you really want to figure out how the heck to kind of approximate that, do let me know and I will add it to the recipes list. <laughs>